Salutations Nick Rookies, welcome back to another video and today we are doing some FNAF news that was recently, well, released and it was actually this Friday that Scott Cawthon officially announced that the Fazbear Fanverse initiative was put into action. So a lot of people have been speculating for a bit that like what's going to be going on with these like fan games and some of them are really well done and actually would really fit into the FNAF universe. So what Scott decided to do um, was basically make the Fazbear Fanverse initiative and now he's helping the creators make more lore and more canon to the actual FNAF universe. Um, so here I'll read, uh, I'll read what's like, uh, what comes up on Google, one of the uh, first few things. It's, this past Friday, Scott Cawthon announced the Fazbear Fanverse, uh, Fanverse Initiative to fund a fan-created game spin-off spin of Five Nights at Freddy's. Scott Cawthon says that he is going to be paying out of his own pocket to support the development of several community-made Five Nights at Freddy's spin-offs. So that means we're, uh, Scott Cawthon is helping funding uh, to make recreations and remasters for console ports of some fan games that really hit it off. And I heard some of them that are being the several uh, development games, or the spinoff games, are The Joy of Creation, which I would love to play for the channel one day. It, um, if you guys don't know what Joy of Creation is, then very much look into it. It's probably like one of the best free roam finance of Freddy's fan games that you'll find out there. Also, there is Finance of Candies. Finally, that that's going to be getting an uh, official release on the console and possibly some merch for all of these series. So that'd be amazing to finally get your hands on, uh, like, what was it? Like, uh, those Freddy, like, Ignited Freddy and Ignited Bonnie and all that. So that'd be really cool. And finally, some official merch of candy. I have a homemade plush of candy, but other than that, that's it. But... Yeah, also, Five Nights at Flumpties will also be getting some of the love and the people who were very generous in making the f remastered version of Five Nights at Freddy's 2. And it's really good. I highly recommend you check out any of these games because they're all amazing and they're finally getting the love and the respect that they very much deserve. So, that's all the news that uh, Scott came out with for this. So, that is really really awesome we're finally gonna uh, see some possible merch like plush or figures of finance of candies the joy of creation finance of flumpties the remaster version and who knows there may even be a couple more but what this is basically saying is that scott coughlin is finally adding to his universe but this is probably going to be its own fanverse so like its own little mini thing off to the side because Scott isn't helping with the production, he's just helping with the financial side. He's not going to be working on any of the games, he's just helping them in the way he can by giving them the money and the support that they need, which is still very freaking awesome. Uh, and that's all the news that we have today. And yeah, so if you guys really like this news about the Joy of Creation, Five Nights at Candies, Five Nights at Flumpties, and the FNAF 2 Remastered version, let me know in the comments below what you guys think about Scott Cawthon finally funding these and possible merch and um, uh, some remasters to the console and to mobile phones. So that'd be pretty freaking cool. But that's going to do it for today's video. Make sure you guys let me know what you guys think of this information in the comments below. Make sure you guys like and subscribe if you enjoyed. And please consider joining the Nicker family for all this daily gaming content. I love you guys all, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye!